Hello! Today we're going to explore how to multiply fractions using visual models. This is a great strategy that shows us what happens when we multiply two fractions. So let's have a look at an example. We've got three quarters times two thirds. We're going to start with our three quarters. First we need to represent this as part of our whole. The four in the denominator means we cut the whole into four equal pieces, or quarters. And the three in the numerator means we have three of these quarters. Now we want to find two thirds of the three quarters we have. In mathematics, the multiplication sign or the time sign can also mean the word of. Again, the denominator of three in our two thirds means we divide our whole, or in this case, our three quarters that we've got into three pieces. Now, this is easy in this particular example because we already have three equal parts, the quarters that we grabbed from our whole. The numerator tells us that we have two of these particular pieces. So this then brings us to our answer. We can see that we have half of our original circle. So three quarters multiplied by two thirds gives us one half. Let's have a look at another example. And this time we're going to use another visual model. In this model though, we are going to represent our two fractions using the same sized rectangle. This is also called the area model. Again, we will start with our first fraction, three fifths. Here, our rectangle is already divided into fifths and our numerator tells us that we have three of these parts. Now I'm going to take another rectangle and I'm going to divide it into quarters and find three quarters of this rectangle. You can see here I've kept the original division lines for our fifths as this is going to help us calculate our final answer. Finally, we are going to overlay our two fractions and see where they overlap. This area of overlapping will give us our final answer. So here's our three fifths and we are going to overlay our three quarters. We can see that the overlapping area, the orange part, covers nine squares and our total area of our rectangle has been divided into 20 equal parts. So that means that our three fifths multiplied by three quarters gives us nine out of 20. I hope you like this video and it's been helpful in helping you understand how to multiply fractions.